Hey guys, welcome to another Lunchtime Review. Today I'm going to be going to Sonic. You can kind of see the sign there on the top left. Um, they have a new burger and a new drink, so I'm going to be trying those out. So I'm going to set the camera up and um, go inside or go through drive through. We're choosing Sonic. What can I get for you? Um, yeah, I want one of your new bacon jam cheeseburgers. All right, would you like the combo or just the sandwich? Um, I really just need the sandwich, but I also want to add one of the new, uh, the, the summer Red Bull uh, drinks. Okay, the dragon fruit or the regular? Uh, the dragon fruit one, is that the new one? Yeah. Yeah. All right, would you like to add any fries or toss to that to make the combo? No, and that dragon fruit one can be a small. Small, anything else? No, that's it. All right, that's gonna be Oh, I'm sorry. The only salads we can do in the dragon fruit is a medium and a large. That, is that okay? Medium is fine, yeah. All right, it's going to be 9.52. Thank you. Thank you. It's going to be 9.52. Yeah, it is. All right, there you go. Sorry about that. <laughs> That's no problem. Yeah, I didn't even realize you had the outside thing. There you go. Have a great day. Thank you. You too. Okay, that was pretty quick and painless. They, it took them a minute to ring up the card because were there's an outside like payment thing where you can uh, put your card in and pay, but I didn't see it. So, um, and it didn't say anything anyway. So I, she just took the card and it was gonna ring it up. But uh, for some reason, it just took a minute to ring up. So I'm gonna park over here in a random parking lot, kind of over here. Hey, okay, so here's the drink, the summer edition uh, Red Bull drink. I think it's dragon fruit. I know what it is. And here's the burger, and it's got bacon and mustard on it. And I'm assuming the jam is on the bottom. I don't know. I'll have to dissect it better when I when I can get two hands on it. But anyway, um, I'm gonna get the camera turned around, tell you how much it costs, and I'll be right. All right, price wise, I think it's kind of expensive. I'm gonna move this drink so I don't drop it in my lap because I know that would happen. Um, that burger, and this is just, it's not a big burger. It's, its I mean, it's not tiny, but it's not huge either. Um, it was $4.99, almost five, it was $5 basically for just that little burger. Um, and the slushy, it's medium. It was $3.99 for the slushy. So my total is $8.98. We have tax here in Kentucky. It was 54 cents from tax. And so my total was $9.52 um, total. Out of, the, out of the door, it was $9.52. So, um, so yeah, $8.98, uh, $9 for one burger and one slushy drink. <laughs> it's a little expensive. Um, now, I could have maybe gotten a combo, but I don't think the combo comes with a slushy drink. They would have added on price for that anyway, I'm pretty sure. So um, I don't know that it would have been any better, uh, better off in the long run. So this is the burger. It does have, I pulled it apart. It does have um, a jam on the bottom. I don't know if you can see that or not, but it does have the jam on the bottom. Um, it's not a ton, but there is some there. Let me make sure I get some in the bite I take. It's over here. Mm. The bacon itself, I mean, not, I'm talking about the sliced bacon, is very, very crispy. Honestly, I'm just getting a bacon, the bacon sliced bacon flavor, the burger, and that's it. I'm not really tasting a jam on there. Hmm. There we go. I just haven't got a really good bite of it. It almost tastes like a, a sweet and smoky, like barbecue sauce is what it kind of tastes like. Um, that being said, I really do like it. It's a smoky, like I said, barbecue sauce. And it's a little on the uh, sweet side. So it bounces out really well with the bacon and the the burger and the cheese. The flavors are really good. My problem was is that they were, they didn't really give you much. They gave you one little blob. It's kind of in the middle. The rest of it's just cheese. They, they the jam should be made sure it's covering the entire bottom. That's my biggest complaint about it. That's going to be uh, different restaurant to restaurant. Some restaurants they might make sure they spread it out a little bit. My guess is most of them just give you a little blob in the middle and that's it. Um, but again, it just depends on who makes it. I know when I cooked, when I put condiments on, I made sure they covered the entire uh, surface if I can, um, at least spread them out a little bit if I could. That was just how I was as a cook. 
Um, all cooks are different though. And if you're making a hundred of these, it's, it's, they weren't that busy, so they had time. But if you're in a really big hurry, you, of course you couldn't do that. I think that's good. I think it's a good burger. I'm gonna rate the burger by itself a four out of five. I do like it, but they need a lot more jam on there. So now for the drink. And again, it's um, it's their summer edition Red Bull, which is a new one. It's dragon fruit. Mm, I like the texture of it. The texture is uh, really fine pieces of ice. Matter of fact, it's not even big enough to actually chew on. It just, just goes down like a liquid. I don't, I've had a dragon fruit before. I don't remember what they taste like specifically. This kind of tastes like, um, it has a peachy like flavor. Um, kind of like a mango peachy um, sweetness. I mean, it's very sweet though. I think if you like the flavor of uh, peach or dragon fruit in general, I think you would like this. It's not citrusy. It's not really melon like. It's, um, it's a good flavor. I like it. Um, I would get it again. I mean, it's really good. I think the calories on it would probably keep you from getting it all the time. But um, if you're not worried about that and you like um, like a Red Bull um, peachy kind of flavor, I think you'd really like it. So that being said, the flavor and the quality of this, I really do like the flavor. It's very, very strong. So um, I'd give this drink a five out of five. I really do like it. It's a good flavor. But you have to like that flavor of the peachy flavor. If you don't like that, you'll, you'll hate it. So yeah, overall, pretty good meal. I think it's a little pricey though. That's my really my biggest complaint is um, both these things are very, very expensive. So hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching.